Hi beautiful Aquarius. Thanks so much for being here. Welcome to Moonrise Cottage if you're new and welcome back to all of my subscribers. I really appreciate, <clears throat> pardon me, all of your support. It's early in the morning here. I can still feel it uh, here in my throat. So bear with me. I've got my cup of tea. Aquarius, all the links for me are below. There are links for the website. The new session for uh, vibrational quantum meditation starts on May 2nd. We'd love to have you join us. We'd love to have your expansive energy. So go to the website, check that out. If you have any questions, fill out a contact form and let me know. The link for my Patreon page is also just below the video. I'm inviting everyone to join me on Patreon to support my channel, especially if you've been following along for a while. I am jumping in now from guidance, uh, from my guides to do some love readings to help those of you who are walking the path of love with intention in your life, connected to your soul journey. Anyone who uh, needs or wants guidance about that, that's what my guides are wanting this year in 2021. So we're going to jump right into it, beautiful Aquarius. Look at this. This is from the Mystical Shaman Oracle. Something is changing. I think your relationship with your beloved is growing deeper. It's very fiery. It's very passionate. And you are walking together into some kind of beautiful destiny, my guides are saying. Well, whoever that person is, you just you hold that love so tenderly and so beautifully in your hands, in your arms, in your heart, in your mind, all of the above, my guides are saying. So look at that beautiful sacred convergence. If you look closely, this is about people arriving on a distant shore. See the boat in the foreground? And what they're doing is they're coming together and they're walking on into the light as a group. And certainly that is what we're all about. My guides are saying that is what we're all about now. We are beginning to cross over into 4D and 5D. It's why there are so many relationships that uh, my guides just said, take up this energy now. So Aquarius, your beautiful partner is nearing some completion point in their life. Look at that. Oops, sorry, the light now coming in the window. <clears throat> the spiral dance of the goddess. Again, walking into the light, walking into the spiral, moving through their destiny, through their shift and change into their completion moment. It's quite lovely. And numerologically, that adds up to an 11. This adds up to a 10. So there's change continuing. This convergence is going forward. This person is walking deeper into the spiral with you for this new beginning. Because they, on a personal level, look up life path numeral nine. They are nearing some, my guys just said the word vast, some vast completion journey. Something beautiful on the circuit of their soul cycle is coming into completion. <clears throat> and I see it in the cards that are here. Mm, goodness, pardon me. <clears throat> So for you, beautiful Aquarius, the Empress, you are in a state of highly ordered vibratory energy. You have the ability to manifest anything that you want. Some of you might be bringing forward children. Some of you are working on a new venture. Some of you are just working with the energy of manifestation in order to imagine what it is you can create that addresses this desire, my guys just said urgency for sacred convergence on a heart chakra level. You may be doing something that uh, allows you to work with the public in some way. Something really beautiful coming forward. This energy is the energy vibration of the relationship. Queen of Wands. Sa my guys are saying same thing. <clears throat> the Queen of Wands is the ruler of her realm. She is extraordinarily abundant. She also knows how to create her environment. 
with love, with passion, with cl certain clarity, my guides are saying. So there's something that you're going on. I think you might really be, you're building the love for sure. You might really be building something to be of service to humanity. So look at that. All, my guides are saying, all across the energy of the relationship. Passion, love, the urge for creation, eight of wands, a lot of energy. While this person has this completion, it's going to bring to them their destiny. And they're in conversation with you about these things. What are we going to create? What shall we do with this relationship? So let's see. Yeah, look. Thank you, Spirit, so much. So for your partner, definitely a completion moment. We're going to put this right here with your partner. Spirit can... Mm, look. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, Page of Wands. Something new, very definitely. Something new. And I think they're speaking with you about this. They're deep in conversation with themselves as well in these days while they are finishing their completion. Hang on. Spirit's talking to me. Yes, they want it here. So, the Hermit. They're going deep inside. You both are. I think you're both inside this incredible... Uh, journey. So allow your partner some space if they need it. They are really in a revolutionary moment. So the Queen of Wands, this is what she's reading over, the Sacred Cup of Love. So the energy of the relationship is definitely twin flame, soulmate, quantum partner. There are variances when we address the words, but for now what my guides want you to know is that this is the love that the Queen of Wands is creating and increasing. She is the conduit for this cup filled with source energy that comes into your life because of the energy that you share. This is what you're creating, <clears throat> pardon me, together. Spirit, what can you tell us please about the Empress? Here it is. Look. You, whatever the two of you are doing together, Aquarius, a massive amount of inspiration, passion, love, abundance, the ability and the willingness and the desire to create because of this. This is really fabulous. Thank you, Spirit. So this love, <clears throat> if you have any questions, this love comes to you because of the energy you've been joined together because of the work you've each been doing in your own life look at that queen of wands again looking right at that I, this is fabulous so you know the empress is the higher order of all the queens in the deck so your energy aquarius is the empress energy and the queens are coming forward have come forward Twice now, Queen of Wands, because this is very passionate. There's a lot of desire to create something new. And you are supporting your partner who's going through their completion process because you know that something is meant to come forward. Very definitely. And you are dealing with this person is very beloved to you. Very definitely. So this is destiny. We don't have any question about that. My guides are saying, we're just going to show you just to confirm it because you already know. Beautiful. And there's the Aquarian energy, the water bearer. My guides are saying a lot of words. They're talking about the dog star, things like that. So bringing this abundance, bringing forward destiny, the ability for the relationship to come to completion there's something that's meant to come. There's some destiny unfolding that has to do with serving, I believe. And you are working, both of you, very hard through the connection and with the connection to look deep, finish a cycle, and begin to have some inspiration. Page of Wands is looking at this because there's inspiration. There are ideas that are beginning to come to the surface that are ready to be spoken. 
put into spoken form. While this person finishes their process, there are two things going on there now. So for you, beautiful Aquarius, this is no surprise. Offering love to this person. Offering love into the connection, my guides are saying. Spirit, what else could we know? And look, there she is again. Wow, Aquarius. This is some very highly ordered feminine energy. There's something that's developing between the two of you. Look at that. So, page of pentacles, page of wands. Something firm and solid is in the process of being created. On both sides of the equation, it might be something that looks like that. It might be that the bond solidifies and you make it a formal bond for some of you. Again, this is the community tent. This is about happiness in the community. My guys are talking about, if they're looking at the image and they're, they are sort of riffing off of that, like in the kingdom, things like that. So I'm going to put this here like this. That's part of the destiny. I'd like to hear from some of you. Leave me some messages. What is it that you are creating? What is happening? Queen of Pentacles. So for your person, they are also looking into the center of the vibration. I think you're working together in a vibrational way, many of you, and that's very conscious. So there's a lot of desire and intention coming forward to create something new out of this very deep introspection. I think your lover, your loved one, whoever that person is, is looking deep into their own abilities to manifest. Thank you, Spirit. Something very solid, something very grounded. This person might have children. You might have children of your own. It looks like there's potential for a child to come forward. So if that's not what you want at this time in your relationship, take caution. Okay? So we're going to, I'm going to leave it there. Um, and we're going to go look. How does this develop? What is it, Spirit, that these two folks can understand about what's coming forward? What is it? Okay, my guys want me to pull one more card. For you spirit can you tell us about yeah this belongs here so as a result of this deep introspection this queen of pentacles energy is going to be activated and when that happens some great temperance you may also need to have patience it may take some time for your partner to do their rotation their healing rotation but again, do you see that we have a reflection of the star card? One foot in the water element, one foot upon the earth in the angelic realm, however you interpret that. In order to blend the energies together, there's something happening for your partner. Her, his or her ability to go very deep and create something very solid, that's the desire that's coming to them. That's why they're working in the way they are. So you have very similar energetic patterning that's going to cause something very solid to come forward. And Aquarius, you're just extremely in your energy. I forgot to say there are links below for the astrology. Please go look at them. It's very important. April's a very active month. A lot of intensity, a lot of shift and change. So, Aquarius, thanks so much for being here. <clears throat> We're going to delve into that in the extended reading. I really appreciate your time to come and pick up your messages. My, guide, I, my guides always, pardon me, say it that way. So I look forward to seeing you in a couple of weeks in the month of May. Till then, be happy and create with abandon. Thank you, Aquarius. See you soon.